Link, after acquiring the mirror shield, becomes the fanciest person ever. And nobody knows why. His fanciness level just rose through the roofs. I just made that rock explode through the roofs. Hey, you're not allowed to do fancy stuff. That's my job. See? Only I'm allowed to do fancy stuff. You can't handle the fanciness of stuff. God. Stinking lizard people thinking that they know how to do stuff. Stuff. You don't just walk around the streets doing stuff all the time. It takes skill. And... Pie demons. Now then... About those pie demons. So that's what we wanted to get done in here. I believe there's a secret area somewhere. Let's just waste bombs. See if we can find it. Not in that one. I feel like I'm playing Jason's LP. Let's put bombs down the walls. Hey, bomb. You look like you need a wall. Hey, wall. You look like you need a bomb. No, I can't find it. Oh. That guy would probably do it. Hey, let's just show it off for the sake of... I don't know. For the sake of I can. That is my reasoning. I am a man. I'm manly. I'm an oil man. Come on. Can't get the angle right. There we go. See? I get fancy things because I did it wrong. Do you get fancy things for doing it wrong? I don't think so. Aw, how nice. They gave us a bomb. They gave me the bombs that I blew up trying to find a hole in the wall. At least there's no old guys saying that I broke their door that they didn't have. That door, you know, that door! Why'd you break my door? You don't have a door, I just saved you! Shut up, give me money! Oh, oh. Don't you see the fanciness? You get to do this. And things happen. Amazing things. Who wants to do some face melting? This is why you don't want to get sunburned, children. Hey, boss door. That is just fancy. Oh wow, that was a really bad idea. That was not so fancy! Um, I'm going to off-screen getting back here because that was not very fancy. I apologize for that lack of fanciness, my goodness. And this, my good friends, proves that the elderly are truly evil. This is not an ordinary enemy. No, this is an enemy with a giant axe. Please, stay away from the axe. Hey! You... 
have a tendency to do stuff. Ugh! Very painful stuff. And have lots of health. Ha! Huh. But wait. It was Naburu! So basically, she was trapped in there for seven years, and then the old ladies hit her with a giant beam of ice and fire, or red and blueness, or whatever you want to call it, and she's gone again. That sucks when you're possessed for seven years, you wait for somebody to come and save you, and then you get captured again. So... Right in here is our next boss battle. Our final boss battle before the final boss battle. So, look at this nice hallway. It's got this nice ornate rug. It's very fancy. It's quality craftsmanship. I made this temple, it's mine! No. Um, so, next time we will fight Kume and Kotake, Twin Rova. Next time, everybody, on Let's Play Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. This is a short episode, but anyways, thank you for watching, and goodbye!